we're in Carson City. We came up with a bunch of little errands to run and go around town. We started off with some lattes. We're having like kind of like a basic regular person Sunday. Yeah. Basic person. Person. Basic, <laughs> basic person. person. We're keeping a PG. Um, but right now we're doing something really basic. We're drinking lattes, lattes from the mm -hmm. gas station. And we're going to Michael's Arts and Crafts uh, store. So I got a couple things that I want to get. What are you going to get? I don't know. We, we want some crafty stuff. Some crafty it's, things. It's fall. And it's it feels fall. like we should be crafting. Yep. Right? Yeah, there's one thing I it definitely want. It feels like we want. should be drinking coffee and crafting. We don't drink coffee. I no, think we, we don't we even We probably drink should it. note that. We don't normally drink coffee. Mm -mm. Like, maybe once every two weeks or something we'll have a coffee. I've been on a little binge recently. Yeah. But, um... One thing I want here is some jeweler's uh, wire. You know, to make some, like, jewelry type of thing. And I have some ideas for the bread truck. So that's definitely one thing I want to look at here. We talked about getting some like epoxy molds or something. You mm -hmm. might look at those. Or if they have epoxy, the two part clear epoxy for some arts and crafts projects, maybe. Mm hmm. And I don't know. You we'll look see. very basic with the, we'll with the coffee. I am basic. <laughs> so basic. Just an average girl. <laughs> Just an average person. Yep. Um, <laughs> and then also, we noticed when we pulled into Michael's Crafts that the Halloween store is right next door. Yeah, Spirit is right there. So. Mm hmm And then we're going to go to a, they, we're going to go to a, a if, casino. If our day weren't basic enough. Yeah, we're going to go to a casino all-you-can-eat buffet for Oktoberfest. And what was the other things? Um, oh, I got to go to a hardware store to get some copper uh, tubing. I have an idea. It'll, you'll see later. Yeah, we're going to go to Oktoberfest. <laughs> October. And then we're going to go to some open houses. And look oh, yeah. At some property. Yeah, that, and there's a property that's for sale in town. We're going to go wow. drive out and uh, look at that property as well. Mm -hmm. we got a full afternoon, guys. Come along with us. <laughs> Every time I've ever locked my keys in my car, which is the twice, um, it's been because I was sitting in the car just hanging out, and then I get out and lock it and close it. Mm hmm it Happens. This manual lock. <laughs> Michaels. You brought your water bottle? Yeah, I'm gonna be thirsty. <laughs> that was pretty funny on Stranger Things when he's like, he goes in the back, or he goes and he's like, do you guys have anything other than orange? And then on his way out, he's like, oh, a green one. Okay. <laughs> Quit being such a baby. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. <laughs> There's all the smoke in the distance. You really see it on, on camera. Oh yeah. yeah, you don't really notice it that much when you're your eyes. Yeah. Here's this property we're looking at. 44 acres, $275,000, two structures on it, including that barn structure that has all this equipment outside of it. We don't know if what kind of if the equipment is included in that price. We really don't know anything about it, but it's pretty awesome out here. We are four miles down a dirt road only about 40 minutes from town, if even. And there's all these field, fields with, it's all fenced in with irrigation. Looks like irrigation running through it. So here's the barn structure, I don't know if you can see it. My favorite part of the property. <laughs> And all these trailers and trucks and tractors and machines. Yeah, there's a dump truck, there's a water truck, pickup truck, a van, an excavator. Uh, that's a big, that's that's more than just a dump truck. It's got two trailers the whole. You yeah, know, there's a separate dump truck on the front, maybe. There's a car coming yeah. down the road. Oh, put a oh, yeah, there's, a, there's a bucket truck, and then there. See that has two trailers on it. 
What's that? The Mack truck. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Semi. Oh, there's a separate excavator behind the house. I'm assuming they would take all this equipment. At least a lot of it. Unless it's all broke down. Not worth it to, to move. Yeah. We could have some fun. I like, I like that barn though. With this stuff for sure. That barn is really cool. It looks the pictures look really nice on the inside too. And all this tractor and this machinery is really cool. We should stop here. These guys are serious business. Look at these lights coming at us. Hopefully they're gonna come tell us about the property, but it doesn't look like. It. <laughs> nope. Wait. So there's the house out there. I want to get out. Sierra Mountains over here and all these awesome wildflowers. It feels pretty dreamy. We could definitely have animals here. Definitely have huge gardens here. And it's kind of cool because even though it's out in the middle of nowhere, there's still some neighbors around. Yeah, there's at least like five little neighbors. At least five. And they have really cool structures too. It kind of feels like everybody's off grid. Mm -hmm. Alright. Officially on the property. Let's walk around the backside and show you away from the neighbors first. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Go to the right. equipment out here oh my gosh imagine all the things we could build that machine what is it power generation unit so it looks see that white box and that's water that's what they use for water, this yep. tank. Oh, yeah. They can just drop it and drive that in town. But it looks like actually pretty recently used. Yeah, there's a lot of equipment out here. Yeah, that's what you're talking about, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's, there's another pickup shop. There's a forklift. There's a that's a road grader, you know. And then the front. Here's front gas. Motor. That's the gas. Yeah. Like with this equipment, you can build so much stuff. Yeah. So much. I mean, that's what I would take to go fix the road. That one. Yeah. The caterpillar. These are old though, you know? Yeah. I mean, to get these working, it might be thousands of dollars. Weren't we just talking about how fun forklifts are? Uh huh. <laughs> Acres, and 
And there's the house. Tucked in those trees over there. The house is in a uh, disrepair. How do you call it? It's half renovated. It's been, yeah, it's kind of stripped a little bit. It's pretty much been taken apart. I think the house was built in 1961. What's that? Yeah. What do you think? I love it. I think it's awesome. I know. I love it too. With these mountains around, it's still the high desert, but there's mountains around and it gets cold in the winter. It's not just flat. So many properties I feel like that I look at are just flat. Nothing to see here. What the house one of the houses open? Yeah, for TV. There's a lot of materials in there for building. Wow. It's like a whole dining room set with that flooring. Cement. Look at that wood ceiling. Mm -hmm. I love the wood ceiling. Yeah. Fan. Oh, it's got a um, fireplace with a wood burning stove in it. Yeah. And a um, brick wall. Kitchen. I love the way the ceiling is in the kitchen and everywhere. It's all. Oh, look at that. Five people used to live here Joe, Mom, Donnie. Danny and Terry, maybe? Aww. What does that say? Oh, Gary. Gary. What's that? Will. Wilk? Willie? Willie Joe? Willie Joe, maybe? Hey, there's water. There's one on both sides. Not on. That was like the master bedroom with a bath. Damn.
And there's an upstairs. Is there a bath over there? No. I don't think so. Yeah. See, that one has, look in this one, you can see the bathroom. From that side. Oh, yeah. It's a tub. Tub and vanity. Dude. You think that's a radiator in the wall? It looks like it. There's no water tank over there. But what do you think's up there? It's a pretty good deal. There's so much stuff in there. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, there's like racks and racks of stuff. Hmm. That's a lot of stuff. Ooh, I love that. That's nice. It's like a nice thermometer. Locked? You know, I don't know what the deal with the water right is too. And like, but that guy we were talking to, like, who knows what his dealing or experience with living off grid is. You know, I feel like you and I are better at figuring stuff like that out and coming up with solutions. But yeah. Again, I don't really know what it means. A little bit of a wildfire going on. A wall of smoke. You can't see that. It's tinted out that way. There's a wall of smoke. Does it look crazy on the camera? Hard to tell. It definitely looks like smoke. Yeah. You guys wanted some fall colors, right? looks like, unfortunately, the past couple of years anyway. You're saying the fire is a fall color from the west? Yep. Oh, I see. Past three, this is my third fall, really traveling around here. And third fall filled with smoke. But then on this We're going to Casino Fandango for Oktoberfest. Rum Jungle. Rum Jungle Buffet. Here we come. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny, Missy? You should have wear your later hoses. 